Good morning! So today I was planning to film a much different video than the one I'm filming right now. I was planning on filming what a day looks like for me as a university student going to school and I was going to film that. I was going to have two lectures and a lab but as you saw in previous clips it is snowing pretty bad. School is actually closed until noon and I'm just not going to go for the afternoon because I don't feel comfortable making my way up this literal mountain. So today I'm going to show you what a productive day off looks like for me as a university student. So normally this day for me is Mondays and half of Wednesday where I still treat it like a working day. So yeah, I'm going to show you what that kind of looks like. It's a very magical day though. So I am very excited about the snow. It's very pretty to look at. And I don't have to worry about going to school tomorrow either because I get the day off anyways. So, yeah. Alrighty, so I always start the days off where I want to be super productive by making myself a realistic to-do list. And I make sure I color code things based on my classes or priorities. And it gives me a really big focus for today. So I always also like to start with the hardest task first, which today was definitely doing my bio reading. So I'm starting with that. Hesitantly. textbook readings for biology. It only took like two hours, but I'm done now. So I was going to take a break and I'm actually trying out the whole audiobook thing and I'm listening to my first ever audiobook right now. It's actually a really good experience, but all the books I put on hold and wanted to read, it was going to take literally months for the first one to come. So I found a book that I was interested in that I wanted to try listening to. However, the only thing is, this is the book I'm listening to. I literally own it, but I'm enjoying it nonetheless. And I'm gonna do that. three o'clock and I've gotten a ton of work done. I did a bunch of math questions. I hinted at an online assignment. I did my biology reading. I did some online quizzes and I feel very productive. I'm actually feeling very motivated and very much in the flow of things. However, my workspace right now is quite a reflection of my mind and it's kind of embarrassing. <laughs> But I'm going to show you anyways.
like I deserve a reading break, so I'm reading Gods and Monsters, which is the third book in the Serpent and Dove trilogy. A trilogy that I started two years ago, but uh, the book hadn't come out, so we will see if I remember anything. Good luck to me. Gizmo is very excited to tell us that we are going to be trying these soda pop lollipops. Jack is trying cherry cola. It actually does taste quite similar. It does? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna try to read it. It does taste like a root beer. What would you like? Whatever you think is the grossest one. Yeah, very grape soda y. All right. A full day later, I am back here with Bubbles. <laughs> and after trying to read the book, I realized that I definitely needed more of a refresher. So I've watched a few of those kind of recap videos or like the what you need to know before reading this book. And now I know like a lot about the characters and I remember all these facts about the characters, but I just don't feel emotionally connected or invested in these characters yet. Which for a like final book in a trilogy, I feel like is really important. So I think it's going to be kind of hard to get through, but I am really excited to finish it because I've been meaning to read this book for a very long time now and I am excited about it and I miss the world. I just hope that like I quickly regain that not only like familiarity with the characters, but also like investment in the characters too. I had a very good day today overall. I actually got a lot more done than I was initially planning to, which never happens. So very grateful for that. And it's only 7.30 p.m. now, but I'm very tired. So I'm probably going to do some more reading and just relax and kind of unwind. Because being a productive university student is actually very exhausting as I'm learning since it's not something I'm very familiar with. I just wanted to say thank you so much for watching this video and thank you so much for spending this time with me. Hopefully I will have a new vlog soon. Bye!